I used to be a high school basketball coach. I was able to motivate kids because I really I have a love and a heart for youth. I was very fortunate to go to the state championship. A youth minister who only played basketball to eighth grade. And I think that my, uh, my history as a basketball coach is really what gave us some inroads and favor into the Minneapolis public schools to be able to worship where we are. We are in, at Ann Wanton Middle School. We've been worshiping at this location for about uh, two years, and so it's uh, been, a, been a great place for us to bridge uh, communities and cultures. But it also has many challenges. I mean, there are a number of disparities in the areas of race, class, and place that we struggle with, and so we're hoping that we can be used by God to be a force of love, of healing, of reconciliation. We want to be a sneak preview of heaven. So our diversity, we hope, does two things. One, it points people to what the kingdom of God truly looks like, that it's multi-ethnic, uh, that it's, it's very diverse. Uh, but we also want to be relevant in an ever-increasing multi-ethnic, multicultural world. When, when sociologists want to prove that there's a racial problem, they point to the church. They say Sunday morning at 11 o'clock is the most segregated hour in America. Well, we want the church to be the solution to the issues of race in our country, not uh, be a part of the picture of the problem of race. We use elements of hip hop, dance, the DJ, the rapper, graffiti art, to express uh, who God is, to express the kingdom of God, to express love, peace, truth, community. Cultural relevancy is important because the culture should not be the enemy, but it's not to be fully embraced either. Culture is both good and bad, beautiful and ugly, divine and demonic. It's the soil we grow up in. It, it's, it's, it's our values, it's our language, it's complex. And so I want to lead a church that engages the culture for kingdom purposes and gives people a sense of hope, a sense of, of love. How we connect with the culture around us is so vital, so important, and leaders need to be equipped and empowered and motivated to be relevant to the culture around them. And it just so happens that an urban hip hop culture is one of the subcultures that's around us, so we engage it.